I think that a, a more complete count, a full count, if you will, uh, and a full count which includes uh, important information uh, on people is just an invaluable tool in a very sophisticated society. Uh, the more we know, uh, the better we can solve problems. The more we know, the better we can forecast about future trends uh, in this nation. So uh, I applaud efforts to improve the census, and I applaud and challenge all uh, to participate and to ensure that every American is counted. The census is also used by uh, private and nonprofit organizations like ours uh, in doing very important research on trends, on directions, on the condition of challenges and problems in the nation. So no one should ever underestimate that the census affects them and their families. The most important way that we use the Census Bureau data is in the development of what we call the Equality Index, which is an index of racial uh, inequality in America. And it's a comparative data uh, a comparative index which compares the status of white Americans with the status of black Americans. And the census forms uh, probably better than half of the data sets uh, that we use. For example, we look at home ownership rates, we look at unemployment rates, we look at death rates due to various diseases, life expectancy rates, voting participation levels. All of these are part of the equality index which is a signature component of the League's State of Black America report that we release every spring. In the past, we've been a Census Bureau information center, uh, I think, uh, to ensure that uh, uh, when we talk to and work with the almost one million people that we talk to and work with on an annual basis, um, then uh, I feel very strongly uh, that uh, uh, to the extent that we know and can help people understand the census, then we're going to be an ally in ensuring an accurate count.